Okay, it's just gone half past six in the morning. I didn't get up at half five. I had a leg tattoo yesterday. I'll show you it. The whole of my left leg got tattooed. As you can see, look, the cat, it wants feeding. Nola, do you want some food? See, told you, it's that time in the morning. You can look outside. I don't make this shit up. I'm doing, I do this every single day. I've got my running gear on. It's time to face everything I don't want to do straight away. And I did this and I've been doing this for a while now. And I tell you what, nothing is in my way. I smash everything. Even the fact that I've got up after a fucking seven, eight hour tattoo sitting. Went to sleep at about 8 p.m. because I was so I felt so ill. I'm up. We have severe weather warnings in the UK. But they don't know me, son. Anyway, let's go do the run. Day in the life of Forex Trade Up, entrepreneur, millionaire, whatever you want to do it. <laughs> let's go. 12 seconds later. Fucking hell. Look at it, look at me. Got snow all on me. It's fucking freezing. But I'm challenging my mind, man. No fucking prick wants to be out here, man. But there's a dog walker to my left. My mates behind me. It's all about challenging yourself, man. No one wants to do anything in life. Being successful is hard. Not being successful is hard. It's all fucking hard. But if you just allow your brain to just drop shit for a serotonin boost, AKA eating junk food, smoking, all that sort of shit. You're never gonna get anywhere, man. You gotta push yourself and challenge yourself every day. Like I am, like, oh, mate, it's so cold anyway. I'm gonna keep going because it's fucking freezing. Apparently the boy, he's hating me right now. He's hating it. Yeah, it's fucked. I'm not gonna lie, it's fucking. This is fucked. It's, the wind's blowing against me. I'm fucking shaking. This is horrible weather, horrible conditions, but do you know what it's doing? Next time when it's a little bit of rain, I'm going straight out, head first. We're gonna get it fucking done. Just finishing off the run. Mentally, I'm beaten. In my head, every single fucking second is telling me to stop. Quit. Fuck it. Here's what it is. Attack problems, man. The mindset is in self-disrupt mode. You gotta remember that. Just showered. This is a physique update. <sighs> Been smashing it out, and uh, yeah, this is the tattoo that I got. I'll stand back a bit. Oh, it's massive. It's absolutely fucking massive. So sick though, and uh, slowly coming back as you can see. Six months ago, I was weighing at like 80 kg, now I'm 66, 67, and like this isn't even difficult. But I'm gonna go eat some food, drive to Starbucks. I've just literally been messaging everyone on Instagram as well, on the business Instagram. So I did some work already this morning, and uh, yeah, I'm just buzz I'm buzzing to get started today. I'm ready for the day, baby. Let's go. Okay, this is my food. Protein, oats, it's a bit too milky if I'm honest with you. This is like my second setup. I don't really use this anymore, but um, it's quite a nice setup to be fair. I don't even know why I don't use it anymore. I just, I've got other setups that I can use. Protein, oats, nothing better after the run. Even in day-to-day -day life, you need to be able to eat clean. You don't even need to exercise. Eating clean is the most important thing to do. You'll be surprised how much junk food you actually eat. Like personally for me as well, I would just eat anything. I'd have bigger portions than I needed to. Like who even invented having three, four meals a day? Like who fucking invented that? Look around us. What's advertised heavily? Alcohol, alcohol's poison. Why, if alcohol's advertised, why is not legal when if you smoke you you feel absolutely fine why is alcohol legal and advertised when that is just as bad as any class a fucking drug out there it makes no sense same as fast food gives heart disease makes you feel like shit low energy clogs up your arteries there's so much advertisement out there and it's just a go-to 
Chocolate is another thing. Oh my God. I had one little square of chocolate yesterday night. The flavors I was getting from that chocolate bar because I just haven't had chocolate in just a few days. It's nuts. And I just wanted to make these day in the lives because people will have their say on your life and X, Y, Z, but you can't listen to the outside noise. If someone's negative, just drop them as a friend straight away. Who fucking cares? You're better off, you are better off alone. I can't lie, you're better off alone. Friends are great, but they're not. They're distractions, they do what you, they do what they wanna do and bring you along. When you actually look at it, it's true. And you need, you guys need to understand we're all on our own journey. We're all our own main characters in life. We get one shot, one shot. Just because you did shit at school doesn't mean you're gonna do shit in the real world. Just because you did amazing at school doesn't mean you're gonna be successful in the real world. I did really bad at school. It wasn't because I was stupid, because look at me now, I'm, I'm earning six figures minimum a month. Fucking million in a year plus. You'll see my level up in, in life in the next 12 months. And my life's been insane for like three, four years now. Ha obviously there's blips, Cool says blips. It's never fucking ascending up like that. There's up, down, up, downs. I pretty much went through fucking depression, you know? So, and that's why I've lost a stone plus. Go to the gym every day, run every day. Have five companies plus set up. Got aspiration. I've got, I'm, I'm dedicated to this graph. And it's just not as easy as one, two, three. But if you're never going to start, you're never going to achieve anything. And also it's all about learning and growing. It's fun. You, there's things that your mind just self-destructs with like, oh, that's long, oh, I don't know how to do that. But if you don't know how to do it, just fucking do it. Find a way to do it. Same with trading, learn how to trade. You don't have to trade real money every single day of the trading week, who cares? Trade once a month, as long as you're profitable, you're profitable, it doesn't matter, you know? It really doesn't matter whoever made up the idea you have to trade every day. Stop chasing success and go get it, go work hard. It's not as easy as what anyone thinks because otherwise everyone will be doing it. But I know, I know just in myself, and if you're watching this, then I know that you guys can also achieve massive things in life. And if you already are, great, good on you. Help others around you then. Be a better person, give to the homeless. Make sure that you're doing a lot for your parents, your wife, you know, everything else. Try and be the best person you can be. Look at yourself in the mirror at the end of the day. Have I achieved what I wanted to achieve? Yes or no? And obviously you can take days off, but you allow yourself mentally to take the day off. So then you are not hard on yourself. You're not going, oh, you're this, you're that. You're bullying yourself into self-disruption. And that's what a lot of people do. And that's what I was doing. But nah, life's too short for that. We've got to attack it, grab it by the horns and fucking take it. So I've got my protein oats right now. Sorry, I just had to get this off my chest, man, because there's too many people I can just imagine what I went through. There's too many people that go through that on a day-to-day -day basis and it's fucking horrible. 8 a.m. right now. I'm gonna eat this, go to Starbucks with the missus and then probably go make some shorts because in the last day in the life, we did seven shorts, which is one a day, but I wanna do two a day. So to do two a day, that means I've gotta do 14. Today is the day Wednesday. Today is the day that I do another seven shorts and start loading two a day and I'm up in my work rate. And then once I've up my work rate, then I've got to maintain. And yo, who cares if I if I drop down on the shorts? I'm doing double what I ever have done ever before. So it's only progress, it's only Ws. That will do sunshine. Right, I got back from Starbucks. Currently, half past nine. It's a little bit wonky, I apologize for the camera angles, but I'm gonna do seven shorts, like I said this morning before going to Starbucks. If I can get these done within the next 20 minutes, send it to my editor by 10, then 10 a.m. I've got another seven shorts done, working towards my goals, chasing my dreams. I'm into coffees at the minute. It's just a little bit of an energy booster, but I make sure I eat before and then obviously I've drunk like 700 milliliters of water already at half nine. Guys, if you ain't drinking water in the morning, yeah, then what are you doing? The body's made up like 98% of water and people out here drinking fucking Red Bulls in the morning, like some crackheads. I don't know what is going on with society, but you need to get some water inside you. Anyway, this is the office as well. I've got a new sign coming. It's going to be XAUUSD. We're going to put it up there. Probably in the next video, it will be there. If you enjoyed the daily lives, then make sure to let me know in the comments down below. Your support means a lot to me. It's not even about a comment, but every single person who gains something from my videos and everything like that, just let me know, man, because I'm here to talk. I'm here to use as motivation if that's what you want to do. And if you want to bully me, then fuck you. If you ain't doing this in your 20s, 
chasing your dreams trying to get rich and all that sort of stuff then what are you actually chasing because right now you're just you're working in the matrix and that's if you're if you're in your 30s and you think your life is over then fucking go to sleep wake up and re look at yourself in the mirror and go this is maybe who i am but i can change and obviously there's going to be ups and down on the road along your journey nothing is easy do you think i want to wake up at six in the morning to run do you think i want to right now self-motivate myself to make content not all the time it's not as simple as one two three do it money isn't also not a motivator like money's great but also a lot of people don't have the money motivation where it drives them and that's fine for me personally as well i'm not out here chasing millions i just out here chasing my own goals myself my self-driven self-driven got my own goals and i want to achieve them you are never gonna believe what i've just done i've just literally done right seven shorts time is now 9 38 eight minutes eight minutes and i've just done a week's worth of shorts please if you're watching this do not tell me you don't have eight minutes in a day to make some shorts of the knowledge that you know to upload on youtube instagram any of those TikToks, you name it it's so simple just to build engagement it's so simple just to get your work ethic working hard if you want to escape escape this is just small it's like eight minutes whatever in the mind have i never done this before eight minutes in my day all i had to do was blast out the content yeah it's all in my mind I make it up on the spot you know how it is but even for myself it just pro it just proves me the amount of time you could watch i don't know even just fucking taking a shit you know i spend at least 30 minutes on the shit up the fact and i work while i'm shitting that's which is i don't even know why i've just got into this but all i'm just trying to say is is that eight minutes and i've done a week's worth of shorts if i've done that in eight minutes what else can i achieve today and it's about doing that all the time and yeah it's fucking difficult but yo do you know what's difficult waking up at 7 a.m getting a train to go to your office and sitting there where humans aren't even designed to sit on their asses all day and just being caught up in all of the bullshit work stuff like people's life work work employees all of that sort of stuff where quite frankly they're not there to better your life they're not there to do anything it's just an inconvenience at the end of the day and it's just one of those things that you gotta look at and just go yeah do you know what tj's actually right here i probably waste at least an hour a day watching bs stuff on tiktok scrolling xyz and as as do i sometimes but just delete the maps clear them off your phone social media yeah was designed for fuck knows what reasons but all i know is is that if you deleted some of these apps yeah and then just started focusing on building yourself as a human as an individual self-development you can get so much done too many people in self-disrupt defeatist mentalities man and it's just as was i and as i am sometimes as i said even when i'm running my brain's telling me stop 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 i ain't even running far yet my brain's telling me to stop like this is what i'm saying i'm no miracle i'm a normal fucking human being and i just want you guys to understand that you can get a lot done if you just keep pushing and i just want everyone to keep pushing let's get on with the day 20 to 10 baby come on Boosh. okay so i'm about to go get a smoothie i just sat there uploaded my shorts to send to my editor i used to edit them all myself but mate i tell you what each short was taking me for a minute short it take me like two three hours i pay my guy six seven pound per short boom i don't even have to do anything so work smart not hard as well but shout out to my editor who does that because mate the guy's a goat um so currently just re-uploading the shorts i made on monday for the in the day in the lives because I actually, um, they just didn't upload on YouTube. I messed it up. And yeah, I'm going to go get a smoothie. I'll probably head to the gym now as well because I'm quite hungry. So quickly go to the gym, have a smoothie, go to the gym, and then come back home, have lunch. So that's my plan. So done my shorts. I was on Instagram this morning doing business stuff, uploading the shorts from the Monday's Day in the Lives and sent my shorts to my editor to do. So it's been, it's a W. It's a W, I can't lie. I can't lie, it is a W. But, um, yeah, that's my analytics right now. They look poor, they look poor, but look, I'll show you everyone. So right now, that is the analytics. I'm going to know life YouTube and all of this sort of stuff. Keep grinding. And uh, yeah, let's see what, what's going to happen in like a month's time, two months time, three months time, four months time. It doesn't really matter, okay? This game's a marathon, not a sprint. My patience, I've got patience to to blow up and it's not even about blowing up i don't actually care about blowing up but right now i'm enjoying the process of making videos being positive driving through i'm a driving force man but yeah i'll take you on a journey to the gym as well of course and uh, let's go baby Woo! big day big day also doing my missus a pop water ball 
before I leave because you know sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Currently in the Batmobile right now. Driving to the gym, I've got to pick up my mate first. But yeah, just just got a smoothie which is pretty calm to be fair. Fucking decent little smoothie. Haven't really eaten much, like I said, protein oats. Um and then that's it. So I'm on a bit like an empty stomach sort of thing, but you gotta remember we weren't designed to just fucking eat whenever we felt like it. We had to go and get our food. Therefore, this system's designed us to keep eating. So I should be fine. I'm gonna burn some fats that is gonna come off me. So I'm clearly gonna be burning the good fats, the bad fats, sorry. And yeah, I've got, got a fucking smoothie. What else do you need in life? So I'll tell you when I'm there, but this is what I'm whipping right now. Still in the Batmobile. All right, in a bit, see you soon. Oh, coming for ya. That'll be mine in a few months time. You watch this space. Oh, oh fucking hell. This is the gym. This is the fucking gym. Quick little fucking cycle. 15, 20 minutes and then chest session. Let's go baby. <laughs> But I'm more forward. Let's go. Real incline, this. Just a fearless set. Boom. Get it done. Good. Gym session completed. Fucking knacker. Look at him. He's actually sweating out. Oh. Man. oh. We did one more chest exercise, then we did abs, and then a five minute cycle. Mrs. has got the fajitas on. We've got to go back, got an interview for TFF at 3 p.m. Got a few business calls before that as well. Time is currently 20 to one, so still a lot of time in the day. And obviously, as you guys know, I'm making a day in the life, so I'm still working. He's working on the Instagram, does not stop. The grind does not stop, and yeah, we're fucked. We're in that gym, I swear down. Could have chundered at any moment. <laughs> and I want it to stop. Like, but we don't want it to stop. Want it to stop. We don't want it to stop because when it gets hard, that's why we're fucking here. We're here to take over. We're not here to fucking simp over what's difficult in life. We're here to take it, grab it by the horns, and fuck it. Let's go, baby. Oh yes. Co-op chicken fajitas with peppers. Look at that, pure gains. Pure gains. Let's fucking go. After I eat this, I've got a few business calls. It's not even 2 p.m. yet. So I'm gonna smash this out, do the business calls, and then yeah, TFF interview at 3 p.m. And then obviously I'll work throughout the evenings anyway because I'm a workaholic. I'm gonna smash this out and let's get back to working, baby. Lunch over, just finished my business call as well. Guys, if you want to be funded, the Forex Funder, they're the best prop firm out there right now. They're the cheapest price. They do next day withdrawals and all that good stuff. Go check them out. Go check the YouTube out, to be fair, as well. Some really good interviews. Thank you for all the support on these daily lives. I really do enjoy making them, and I'm going to continue Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Hopefully, I can continue. Every single day, like this today, is my normal life. Tomorrow, I haven't taken a rest day in about... 10 days since I was like ill. So I'm gonna take a rest day, 100% tomorrow. And then Friday, we'll get back recording our day in life. So let me know if you do enjoy them. And um, it's only 10 to two. So it's 10 to two. Look how much I've done already before 2 p.m. As I said, we've got interviews still to do today. Load of work on Instagram, load of work on my socials. The grind doesn't stop, but I'm gonna send this to my editor so we can upload it for 6 p.m. tonight on my channel. Thank you, honestly, for the support. No, no, I say thank you. Yeah, no, this is thank you as well. Now, honestly, guys, no trading either. Hopefully, we'll trade on Friday. I've just waited for the markets to even out as gold sold off so much. And it's about learning to have patience, not rushing the process. Please remember that. I try and preach a lot in my shorts about this, but 
You don't have to look for a trade every single day or every other week. Take your time. There's no rush to be rich. Anyway, thank you. It's been your boy TJ. Peace.